Hey everybody, Anthony here, SpecialtyMotorCars.net. Got another nice silver Panther to bring you this week, folks. 2008 Lincoln Town Car Signature L. L for the long wheelbase, extended rear doored town cars. Very rare cars to find. Uh, a lot of these cars were scooped up by livery fleets and now have three, four, five hundred thousand miles on them, are used up and uh, pretty much abused and thrown out. Uh, this car is the complete opposite. This car's got 56,000 original miles, being privately owned since new. Uh, this car is a two-owner car. I bought it from the second owner who purchased this car in 2015, I believe, uh, with 8,000 miles on it. The original owner, I am told from the gentleman that I bought the car from, was a wealthy lady. This car was registered out of Miami Beach, Florida. And uh, she had it. And she used this car personally, was chauffeured around in it. And uh, it shows that it was really well cared for and it could have been used for a personal chauffeur vehicle but never commercially registered. Uh, she bought it brand new at M&M Ford. And they were in uh, upstate area New York. Traded back in there with 8,000 miles and it was sold to the owner that I got it from uh, he bought it from M&M Ford and uh, took great care of it himself uh, he was actually uh, a limousine company he owned a limo company but this was his own private car never livery used never chauffeured privately uh, registered to himself and privately insured in the state of New York uh, this car shows really nicely. It's a beautiful silver with black leather interior. And uh, it's just like that Grand Marquis that I just listed a few days ago. Really nice, really clean car. Shows very well. Doesn't really have much damage to speak of, even nicks and dings. Uh, go down the side here. You can see how nice and straight this car is. There's the signature L marking. Four brand new tires that he put on last year really have almost little wear on them. Uh, it also has four brand new brakes all the way around, pads and rotors. Got a few little minor things though. Little tiny scratch there. You can see a little scratch right there. Uh, all little stuff, even the door edge, very clean. Corner of the mirrors, no marks or scrapes there. Another shot of the alloy wheel. A little bit of corrosion right around the cap there. Come around to the front bumper. Headlights are very clean. They are HID headlights. Shows very well. Even the license plate bracket, these are common to split and pop like wide open right up in the corners here. And this one is in really nice shape. You can see even the gloss on the hood. Stand up hood ornament brought back in 2003. Come up over the windshield. Original windshield. Roof. No dings or crazy scratches. The only one thing I did notice, which is kind of odd on this car, on this pillar here, you can see this black rubber is bubbling. Rear windows are tinted dark black. Come down over the trunk. Really nice shape back here. The bumper, no scuffs or dings in the bumper. Even this Lincoln uh, panel here, this Lincoln panel, you usually start to see little wrinkles right in the corner of these panels. This one is absolutely mint. Really nice, all the emblems and letters are there. Usually the R's fall off of these, very common as well. It's a really nice car. 2008 Lincoln Town Car Signature L, long wheelbase car. I'm gonna spin it around. We'll show you the inside after that, open the hood and the trunk, and we'll take it for a spin. All right, got the 2008 Town Car spun around. We'll show you around the passenger side here of this beautiful silver Lincoln Town Car Signature L with that six inch extended rear back seat area. 56,000 miles, like I said before, on this car. Really a nice car, two-owner car uh, with lots of service records. I have a binder full of all types of records for this car.
from when it was bought uh, used with 8,000 miles all the way up until now. I'll show you this side first. We'll get back inside the car. We'll take it for a spin. But you can see here how nice and clean the chrome is on the front of the car. Beautiful chrome grill. No bug marks or really anything on the front of this car. Beautiful headlights, HID headlights as well. Come around this side here, you can see the nice chrome fender lip moldings. Full wheel new brakes, like I mentioned before. Beautiful alloy wheels. Very minor corrosion right on that edge there. You can see the hood shows well. Beautiful windshield, the original Lincoln windshield. Come up over the top. Come back down over here. Go down the side here. Really nice and clean. A little bit of a chip right there. It looks like another one right there. Maybe a little bit of a door ding right there. Looks like a little another minor door ding there. Again, that dark black tinted windows in the back here. Signature L insignia on the quarter. Rear wheel on this side. Another showing of a little bit of corrosion right on the outside edge there. 17 inch alloys. Come around the back. Now I know this back bumper had been painted once before. Uh, the owner of the car gave me all types of records and stuff. And I think there was some records in there of some body work on the front. I think there was something on the front too. I'll take a look and show you what I got for records. And I know also on the back here, he said he was coming to a stop and someone tapped him from behind. But yeah, that's the passenger side of this beautiful 2008 Signature L. We're gonna get inside and show you the inside of the car and then we'll take it for a spin. All right, we're gonna open up the 2008 Town Car Signature L. And as everybody knows who already watches my channel here, this is the normal time I plug my channel. Bottom right hand corner, hit that subscription button if you like what you see. Take a look at some of my older videos. You can see what I normally sell, these big mom and pop cars, Lincoln Town cars, Cadillac Bromes, all types of stuff. I got stuff coming in all the time. These big mom and pop sedans that you just don't see anymore. All really clean, low mileage examples. So hit that notification bell as well. So every time I list something, you'll be the first to know about it. Getting in the inside of this car, very rare car. Now I've had a few of these L Town cars in the last year, actually, three of them. And I never know when I'm gonna get the next one in. And uh, in all the ones that I had, I had a few people call me and say, I'm looking for a silver one with black leather. And silver with black leather is kind of hard, believe it or not, is a hard color to find in these town cars. Uh, so this one, having silver and black leather, is definitely a unique find. It's not black on black, it's not burgundy or white, it's silver or black leather. So signature, it's not a base car like the Executive L's. You can see here, you got nice features like the uh, memory seats, the heated front seats, all the window switches and controls there. Little pop-up cubby hole here to store stuff in. That still operates perfectly. Usually these buttons come flying out. All these little caps here are all present, nice shape. Those all fall off. This car was really well kept. The gentleman that had this car really truly loved this car. And if you saw the video that I had when I picked this car up with my buddy Paul out in Poughkeepsie, it was kind of sad because this guy had a family run limousine company that he had a fleet of cars in. And like I said, this car was not one of those fleet. This was his personal car uh, that he kept in his garage, tucked away underneath his uh, Nova on a four post lift. Uh, this car he loved and cherished and really didn't want to give up. But unfortunately, due to the coronavirus, he was shut down and, and literally business stopped. So this car had to go just to uh, put some money in his pocket, unfortunately. But you can see here, beautiful black interior. You have your adjustable foot pedals, automatic headlights, traction control, beautiful leather wrapped wheel. We'll get into that in a minute when I get up into the cockpit area and take her out for a spin. Let me show you the best part about this Lincoln Town Car. You see how wide those doors open? Almost a 90 degree opening on those Town Car doors. Really clean, nice, beautiful door jams. 
the threshold here nice and clean with a big Lincoln insignia and that beautiful rear carpeting here you can see how nice and well preserved this car is in the back now we'll get back to the door panel here and you can see it has all the appointments back here your uh, switch for the window heated seat switch little pop open ashtray with a cigarette lighter there nice door pocket to put different types of things in magazines or whatever beautiful back carpeting freshly shampooed now the L cars are kind of unique they have this center cup holder that folds out just like the front and then in the back here you have a little tissue dispenser this control here controls the forward and reverse motion of the passenger front seat to give you more even more leg room and then right in the dead center there you can see the radio controls and the climate controls for the uh, front area in the center here this opens up you have twin cigarette lighters or auxiliary outputs and then there's a remote control there that is for let me show you up in the roof here you have two dual vanity mirrors and then a dvd player as well so that's what that control is for is the rear dvd system in this lincoln town car uh, that was installed by the previous owner, the first owner. Uh, the gentleman that I bought the car from told me. Uh, so that was in the car previous to him getting it, I believe, for the lady who was driven around in this car privately. I'm going to spin it around. We'll show you the passenger side, inside and out. We'll come right back. So let's take a look at the inside of this beautiful town car on the passenger side. Open up that 90 degree big swing here how nice and wide that opens up for easy entry and exit jams on this car are beautifully clean all the way up you can see here how nice this one is in the back seat as well uh, on this side nicely shampooed carpets freshly done it's really like your own private limousine back here readjustable headrests at dark tinted windows and like I said before at the vanity mirrors and the uh, rear DVD system Let's see here same as on the other side you have your heated seat switches dual power seats another little pop open cubby map pocket down on the bottom there and again inside the jam nice and clean very presentable it's a beautiful car really well kept the gentleman who had this car really uh, it was bittersweet to sell this car and i kind of felt bad taking it away from him too because he looked like he was gonna cry in the driveway and i don't blame him he knows how rare this is he drove town cars for years had him in his company loved him so much that he had his own and this was his own car See here the beautiful carpeting again, freshly shampooed. Show you the beautiful dash there. Nice black interior and the silver Lincoln Town car really sets it off. I'll take a look inside the glove box here. I know I have all the books and stuff like that with it. This is the USB cable here for the radio. And like I said once before, I do have two sets of keys with this car so we'll get behind the wheel open up that hood open up the trunk and uh let's take her for a spin all right i'm going to show you under the hood of this car and in the trunk and i got the key fob in my hand but before i get inside the trunk and under the hood i want to show you those beautiful hid headlights uh warm up and glisten that beautiful bright white Really hard to find option on these Lincoln Town cars. A lot of them came with the standard halogen bulbs. You grab this little handle here, that hood opens right up. You can see here how nice and clean the engine bay is in this Lincoln Town car, 56,000 original miles. All the plastics are in really nice shape. Really well kept. Show you some of the service records that I have with this car in just a minute. that hood down all right the next cool thing I got here is this is one of the key sets of keys that I have with the remote if you push the 
uh, trunk button on these. It's pretty neat. Twice. And you have your power opening and closing rear trunk. Beautiful <laughs> trunk space on these cars. I love the trunks. Huge, deep trunks. You can see here there's that rear uh, little extended floor mat for the uh, rear of this car. Unique floor mat set for the, these cars only. You had that big rear mat that went right over the center hump, the, the transmission hump with that Lincoln emblem in the middle. And then right up on the top there, you can see the two front mats. Uh, the spare tire, like I said in videos before, on these town cars, they were put over in the quarter panel here, which is a great spot because usually they hang them over here in the older versions. And the overhang of the tire kind of cuts down on some of your trunk space. Uh, so that's kind of a Debbie Downer, but this was a great idea. Unfortunately, it was in the last generation of the town car. But, oh well. Push it again. That trunk comes down, closes, pulls down perfectly, just as it should. And that's it. That's the 2008 Lincoln Town Car. Now let's take her for a spin. All right, we're inside the 2008 Lincoln Town Car Signature L. 56,000. 492 miles on this beautiful silver Lincoln Town car. We're gonna take it for a spin outside. We'll get it out. Get those headlights on. Take it for a spin out of the shop here. Automatic seat belts engage. Beautiful autumn day here in whoop, New Hampshire. Let's take this. Beautiful Lincoln for a ride. She accelerates smoothly. I drove this car back from Poughkeepsie. Uh, I put about uh, maybe 200 or so miles on it. Uh, like I said, it's got full wheel new brakes uh, that oh, I just had recently put on. And then uh, the previous owner to me just had uh, four new tires put on. I also have a lot of service records with this car um, that all come with the car. A nice little binder uh, full of stuff. Clear to go. Then I will include uh, with the sale of this car two sets of original keys. All that good stuff all comes with this Lincoln Town car. Shifts through all the gears, nice and smooth. She's nice and quiet on the road. You can see the trees are changing colors. Days are getting shorter, unfortunately. Uh, with that, like I said in my last video, I'm gonna start doing my videos inside. Just a lot easier to capture the cars inside uh, where the outside with the sun going down so quick, it's hard for me to get a good time with the sun so close. But it's all good. I like being inside. No wind noise, no car noise, none of that stuff. All right, we're gonna take a right here. One thing I'll show you as well is a nice aftermarket Pioneer head unit in here uh, with USB hookups. There's a USB cable in the uh, glove box, and it also has a navigation and Bluetooth. Uh, which is quite nice, you know, for a car like this, you're on the road a lot. Uh, normally, I don't like aftermarket radios and that kind of stuff, so I would normally take that out. But where it's got Bluetooth and navigation, and this is a modern car, not a really a classic, I opted to leave that in the car um, you know, for the next owner to make a decision if he wants to keep it or not. It is pretty basic to use. It's the back roads of New Hampshire here, beautiful. Anyways, we're gonna get it back to the shop here. This car is gonna get advertised at $15,995. Uh, my name is Anthony. The number here is 978-930-1004. Check my website, specialtymotorcars.net. And also check me out on Facebook, Specialty Motor Cars up here in Pelham, New Hampshire. Uh, don't let distance stop you from buying a dream car like this of yours. Uh, I can get this car delivered right to your front door uh, at a very, very reasonable price. 
let me know where you are and how I can help you get this car to where you need to be. And uh, I'd love to help you out. 978-930-1004. Again, my name is Anthony. Thanks for watching. All right, folks, before I cut the video out, I want to show you just the uh, paperwork that I have with this car. You can see here I got both sets of keys and the remotes. And I got this real thick binder of all types of receipts and documentation, battery changes, oil changes, tire rotations, uh, insurance cards, which I'll probably take out, uh, all types of stuff in here, all types of service work, registrations, etc. Some of the personal stuff I'll take out, like the registrations and um, the insurance cards, but tires, tire rotations, uh, all types of good stuff. Pictures of the car. The car was bought new with 8,000 miles on it. Or used, I should say. Uh, the original Carfax. When the car was bought new in 2015. Uh, that was uh, with 8,000 miles on it. Some of the original paperwork. Bills of sales. Uh, M&M Auto Group. They like said that's where the car was bought new. That's ultimately where the car was traded in. So this binder will come with the car. Both sets of keys they have all four floor mats, including the WeatherTech front floor liner comes with the car. Any questions, give me a call, 978-930-1004.